new functionality for the presets, update to HDR merge or some refreshments to the user interface. Well, those are just some of the new additions for the latest Luminar Neo update with the number 1.22. So if you're ready, we're going to look at it right now. OK, so moving into Luminar Neo, where we're going to start in the presets section. Here we're going to look at some of the new functionality, starting by looking at our main editing toolbar. You already know the section on the top called for this photo, which basically give you an idea or tip on the preset collection you could apply to your image. So let's say that we're going to go into the urban style. In past, you were able to hover over the different presets. And by doing that, they basically show you a preview of the edit on your own image. Where now, additionally, the thumbnails of the presets also show you your image with the preset applied to it. So this is another step of speeding up the entire process of editing and just speeding up the selection of the preset. So you can then very quickly just select another preset and apply it to your photo. Another new functionality comes with the favorite section of your presets toolbar. In past, you were able to select a preset, a single preset, which maybe work often for your images or you really like it and add it into your favorites section. How you do that? Well, you just open any of the collections and let's say that the Melbourne work all the time. So you just click on a little heart icon and then next time you need to use it, rather than looking for the urban collection, you go into the favorites and here your Melbourne preset is located and you can simply apply. But now with the new version of Luminar Neo, you are able to add an entire collections. Well, how to do that? Well, here in a favorite section, rather than just presets, you also have an option to click on collections. And when you do that, the collections are here. So, for example, I can go into purchased and let's say that I like the autumn mat. I use it a lot at this time of the year. So I click on the little heart icon in the top right corner of the collection, return back to the main view, click on favorites, go into the collections and the autumn mat is here. So I think this is another great step of making organizing the presets much easier. Now, finally, here in the presets module, when you scroll all the way down on your main editing toolbar, you will notice a section called new marketplace arrivals. And here you can have a look at some of the latest preset collections that were added to the Skylum marketplace. You can preview them and get them. Moving to the catalog, where we're going to look at the update for the HDR merge. Let's just grab the three images. And by doing that, we can now drag and drop them on the actual HDR merge tool. Once we do that, number of options appear and the update for the HDR merge in this latest update is the possibility to apply distortion correction. So now finally, we can apply a number of corrections to really get the best possible result, including the auto alignment, distortion correction, chromatic aberration and ghost reduction. So we are pretty much at the level of the raw development, allowing us again to get the best possible result. So next time you're going to be merging your HDR files, don't forget to jump into the settings by clicking on the circle with the three dots and apply the distortion correction alongside the other options available. Additionally, the latest update brings support for new cameras, including Canon, Leica, Sony and Nikon brands. And as usual, it also brings number of bug fixes. And finally, it also includes a new way to join the referral program and get extra discount for your friends and maybe few benefits for yourself. Now, how you can access it? When you are in the catalog module, you will notice a little banner at the bottom left corner. Now you can access the program from there by clicking on invite friends 
or you can close it from here and remove the distraction and navigate to the top right corner of your screen, click on extras and here click on the referral icon. Here you will be able to find out more about the program and more importantly, copy and access your own link. This is the link you should be sharing with your friend to give them the 30% discount and to start collecting your benefits. Depending how many of your friends will join and start using Luminar Neo, more benefits will come. By the way, if you are interested in this referral program, then I have a full tutorial that you can watch going through the entire process from sharing the link and finding out about which of the benefits you're going to get. So join me on this next video simply by clicking the link right here.